Welcome back to Teltanic. This is Watch Talk Fit coming at you with 37 fast food hacks you never knew about. Takeout food has been around for hundreds of years, and in medieval London, you could buy anything from hot meat pies to sheep's feet and French wine from street vendors. In Paris, you could purchase tarts, cheese, eggs, and roasted meat from the side of the road too. It was popular amongst the poor, as many of them didn't have their own kitchens at home. The fast food game has changed tremendously, and today we have a look at some hacks that could save you money and make your tummy very happy. Number 37, make it your own. If you love a good burger from Burger King, here's one way to guarantee that the patty is fresh and has been sitting around all day. Customize your order. That way, the staff will have to make you a brand new one to meet your exact specifications. Number 36, I'm loving it. This is known as the poor man's Big Mac, and Serious Eats gives you a great way to save a bit of cash. Simply order a McDouble at McDonald's and doctor it a little. Have them hold the mustard and ketchup, add a little lettuce and some Big Mac sauce, and there you have a Big Mac, minus the bun in the middle, which you won't miss at all. Number 35, on the go. If you're a little clumsy and tend to spill your ultra important Starbucks, simply ask them for an upgraded cup, which gives you a little more space and potential leaks and spills are avoided. Number 34, bite to eat. If you had to jack in the box and you're not in the mood for a sourdough jack, you can order the sourdough bread for any sandwich you choose. Number 33, easy over. So you love McDonald's sandwiches, but you're not that keen on scrambled egg. No problem. You can request to have a round egg instead. They don't cost anything extra and probably taste better too, as the egg is super fresh. Number 32, the more the merrier. Instead of ordering the larger portion of McDonald's chicken nuggets, order them in separate boxes. It works out cheaper and you get extra dipping sauce. Number 31, double the crunch. At Taco Bell, you can ask the staff to add Dorito shell directly into your cheesy gordita crunch. The extra crunch you'll get is definitely worth the additional 30 cents. Number 30, the secret is out. Most people are aware of the secret menu at In-N-Out Burger, and you have to try animal style fries next time you're there. Many takeout places have a secret menu, so check it out online before you go as you wouldn't want to miss out on something amazing. Number 29, Quench your thirst. You are thirsty but have no cash for a bottle of water. Head to Starbucks and ask for a venti iced water. It's free and does the job in no time. Number 28, it's crunch time. Next time you're at Taco Bell, ask the staff nicely to grill your meal a second time. The extra crunchiness just makes it even more delectable, as if that was even possible. Number 27, the best things in life are free. And one of those free things is food. And who can say no to free food? Many establishments run special offers, so keep your eyes peeled for them. Every Valentine's Day, Starbucks run a buy one, get one free promotion. Cinnabon gives out free Cinnabon bites on occasion. And some AMS theaters hand out free popcorn too. So follow your favorite takeout places on social media to see what freebies they're giving out and cash in. Number 26, a little extra protein. If you're an Arby's fan, then this is the hack you need to remember. You can get a lot more meat by ordering two junior size roast beef sandwiches as opposed to one regular. It costs you less and you get more food. Number 25, cost saving. It can be tough being a student because finances are usually tight. So be on the lookout for places that offer student discounts. Even if they don't advertise, always ask. You have nothing to lose. There's a number of places that will give you 10% off your bill or give you a free dessert or cold drink. Number 24, Jungle Juice. Jamba Juice has an entire secret menu that is awesome, but one of their specialties is sweet and sour fusion known as Pink Starburst. It's meant to taste like the pink colored Starburst candy and includes several key ingredients like tart lemonade, sweet strawberries, and fruity raspberry sherbet. The combination sounds heavenly. Number 23, it's the little things. In and out Burger doesn't serve bacon and probably never will. Nobody seems to miss it though, which says a lot about the tastiness of the burger. You can customize your burger in other ways though, like asking the chef to mustard fry your patty or getting a good helping of chopped chilies, my favorite. Number 22, I put ketchup on my ketchup. 
Ketchup and fries go hand in hand, and to avoid making a massive mess when you get takeaway fries and the little cardboard container, flip the top of the carton back and put your ketchup into the space. No mess, no fuss. Number 21, Razzle Dazzle Them. If you have an unexpected dinner to host, head down to KFC and order a double down. You can take that double down and convert it into cordon bleu, which is basically what it is. Stuffed chicken, filled with cheese, and cured pork. Add some fresh herbs and delicious salad and you're set to impress. Number 20, against the grain. If you're a Chipotle regular, you're probably cashing in on this already. But if not, then know this. If you head to Chipotle, you can order extra rice with anything and they won't charge you. Number 19, chow down. Informally, Canada's national dish is known as poutine, which is fries smothered in cheese curds and gravy. Head to participating KFC stores and you can order poutine for yourself. And you don't need to be in Canada to do so. Number 18, time on your hands. If you have a little extra time and you're all for fresh, hot fries, then there are two ways going about getting them. You can either hang around and wait for them to make a fresh batch, or you can request yours without salt. Basically, forcing them to make a fresh batch. Sans salt. Number 17, a little steamy. And we're still talking about food. McDonald's burgers can come with some seriously dry buns at time, so request a steamed bun instead. They usually serve their filet -o fish with a steamed one, and it's light and fluffy and can make other sandwiches taste so much better. Number 16, an apple a day. Here's a secret menu hack that is well worth remembering. Head to McDonald's and ask for an apple pie McFlurry, which sounds every bit as amazing as what it tastes. They take bits of their apple pie and put it in with the ice cream and it's heavenly. Number 15, say cheese. It's not on the menu, but you can order a grilled cheese from McDonald's. All you need to do is ask for a cheeseburger minus the meat and ask them to grill the burger with buns facing outwards. Number 14, nothing in life is free. Well, not in this case, as Chipotle offers you free chips, guac, or queso if you order a regular priced entree. So don't feel bad for asking, it's on the house. Number 13, drink up. Nothing beats eating Nutella straight from the jar, except for maybe this Nutella coffee from Starbucks. It's called a Cafe Misto, and it's made by using one pump of chocolate and one pump of hazelnut and a little caramel drizzle for luck. It's like drinking your Nutella in coffee form. Number 12, tight budget. Keen to save $1.19 and still enjoy a meal at Arby's? Get two junior roast beef sandwiches instead of a classic roast beef sandwich and you get the same amount of food with the additional saving. Also, check the back of your receipt. There may be a number there that you can call to complete a survey. Once done, head back in line to get your free sandwich. Number 11, sink your teeth into this. No doubt about it. Philly cheesesteaks from Subway are delicious, but up your intake by ordering a double steak and cheese. Same sandwich, more meat, and it saves you $1.50. Number 10, meat meat, a man must eat. Who's going to say no to a little extra meat in their Chipotle without extra cost? Order half chicken and half beef, and you'll get your order jam-packed with meat and no additional charge. Number nine, taste the same. If you're heading to Jack in the Box, order two Junior Bacon Cheeseburgers and combine the two, and you're left with a much more affordable option than the Bacon Ultimate Cheeseburger. Number eight, kid for a day. It can get quite pricey to eat at Pandas, so next time, order off the kid's menu. The portions are honestly not that small, plus you get something to drink and a cookie. Totally worth it. Number seven, excellent combination. At one point in time, you could order a wickedly good combination at certain Shake Shack locations. It was the peanut butter burger, but due to concerns over the peanut allergies, they took it off their menu. However, don't despair, you can order one, although it may not look like the original. Go to Shake Shack, order a Shack burger with bacon and ask for a side of peanut butter spread. You know what to do from there, and don't be surprised if everyone behind you in line starts ordering the same. Number six, in pizza, we crust. So you're a vegan and your friends love pizza. No problem. Domino's and Pizza Hut offer meat-free options. And on their thin and crispy menu, they have options with no cheese, plus crusts are made without dairy. Number five, go better together. That's chicken and waffles. And if this is your type of food, head to McDonald's and order McGriddle off their breakfast menu. 
This option is made by replacing the sausage and bacon with a fried chicken patty and don't forget the syrup. So many people order this combination, it surprisingly haven't added to their menu as a standard option. Number 4. A little extra in your pocket. Keen to save $10 when ordering pizza? Order a large carryout, three-topping pizza, and ask for ham, bacon, and pineapple. You pretty much have an Hawaiian pizza just without the parmesan and roasted red peppers. Order those as additional toppings, and it works out way cheaper. Number 3. Worth a try. You can try this one with any pizza place. Give them a call to find out if there were any orders that weren't collected or delivered, and you're bound to pick up a pizza at a discounted rate. Number 2. Keep it cool. Iced coffees are the perfect refresher in the summer, and here's a way to save $1.60. Go to Starbucks and order one shot of espresso and a cup of ice. Add your own milk and sugar at the sugar station, and you have a perfect iced coffee. Bonus, you can add less sugar, making the beverage slightly healthier too. Number one, keep calm and eat nachos. An item that is not part of the Chipotle menu is nachos, but there is a way to enjoy these bites of heaven when you head there. Ask for a bowl of tortilla chips and then order whatever toppings and meat you like and make your own delicious nachos. Do you have any fast food hacks that you can share with us? Let us know in the comments below. And subscribe to Teltanic and don't forget to come over to my channel Watch Topic. Thanks so much for watching.